Hello guys, welcome to my video series tutorial to talk about Microsoft Semantic Kernel. In this video, I am going to focus on how to create a plugin from the function. So far, we have implemented a class plugin and inject the class object to the kernel. Now, instead of this class, we are going to implement only and function to the kernel plugin. Let's start how to implement this feature. One class called web plugin. This plugin contains two functions, one for bike information and another one for car information. So my idea here is I don't want to implement this web plugin into the kernel object. Instead of that, I need only the bike information should inject into the kernel object. That's our idea. So the first step, go to the program.cs file. Here I have created the kernel object. Up to this is fine. The next step here, I am going to first create the object for the vehicle plugin. So load plugin here, vehicle plugin, just new, create the object. The next step, I have to use kernel function factory class. So kernel function factory dot this factory class contains two functions, one for create from method and another for create from prompt. So here I used create from method. Here you have to pass this method info or you can create the delegate method also. I go with this delegate method. So at some moment there is no argument. This one vehicle dot bike information. So the bike information need one input. So here I have to define my input also string input. This information I passed to here this function function argument input. So the next argument is a function name. Function name name of vehicle plugin I keep like this and the final argument is a description I leave this at the moment here so this create from method return the kernel function as a return type so here I define the kernel function so here I assign to this bike information to this one fine so our function is ready. The next step, we have to pass this function into the kernel dot plugins dot add from function we have to use. We have already seen add from object, add from type. Now we are going to use a function called add from function. The first argument is a plugin name. So here I define my plugin name is a dynamic plugin or maybe function plugin. Function plugin. The next argument is a description. So the description of this plugin find bike models. Models or model information. The last argument is the kernel function we have to pass. So this is the i enableable. So we have to create the i enable object. For that I use this new and pass this bike information. So this create from method function return the bike information. This is a kernel function here I passed. So our plugin is ready. Finally, I prepare the input. So I just pass the dummy data bike one two twenty three and invoke the object so I put the breakpoint here start the application
if you go to the kernel builder plugins one function available here and the name we define as a vehicle plugin if you run the application we can see the result so here we achieved two concept one for we create dynamic plugin function and inject the second one is we not implemented all the plugin function to the kernel plugin so instead we can pick which function we want to import into the kernel object i hope you can understand how to use this feature thanks to all